Okie dokie. So let's look at tables in Markdown. Markdown tables look fugly. They 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 are just funky, weird looking things. But I guess if it's meant to be simple to read and it helps format it, then uh, I guess this is the, the most logical way they could do it. So um, how tables work in Markdown is your pipes. So uh, the first pipe would start, would signify the start of the table. Um, and this would have to be the column, column one. And then you wrap your columns in pipes. So column two, pipe, column three, pipe. Um, and then all of your subsequent data, rows of data, uh, needs to be in um, in pipes as well. So that's row one, uh, column one, sorry, pipe. Um, row one, two, pipe, and row one, column three, and it end that with pipe. So that in itself isn't going to do anything. Um, the, 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 this is the, the sort of fugly bit I was talking about. This is to help uh, the, the markdown parser identify it's a table. So you need to put in uh, a pipe and then hyphens. Um, I think it just needs to be one. That signifies one column, um, two column, and three column. And this is where prettier comes into play. So if I hit save here, it, you'll notice it, uh, it formats it to, to the width it needs to be. And uh, you'll see in the table here, uh, formatting is not great in like the standard VS Code um, Markdown formatter, but I suppose it's 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 okay. So let's just make this table a bit bigger, and two, three, four, and. I really want to have everyone sort of watch me go through this. Um, yeah, why not? I mean, I've, I've had people screaming at me for making typos on videos before, so um, you're welcome. So that's cool. Uh, but say if this information here is like financial information, so, and it doesn't usually get aligned on the left when it, oops. When it's uh, when it's numbers, um, it usually gets lined to the right. Um, but it's not doing it like that here. So yeah, we can sort of see it here. Right. You notice they're all aligned to to the left here. Uh, what we can do in Markdown is uh, use the colon indicate where you want the um, uh, the text aligned so default is on the left so just put that there uh, and you can do it to the right and then you see everything gets aligned to the right if you want everything aligned to the center um, uh, where everything centered put a cone on around either either side Save, and you'll see that. So, um, just this, um, this this sort of weird. I wouldn't say, but this syntax here to indicate to uh, to to the Markdown parser, which uh, you know there is the table, and use the colons either side of the hyphens to indicate if you want it aligned left or right. So. Um, that's it for Markdown, um, Markdown tables, but but I think that's it for the course as well. Um, I'll, I'll list a link of resources in the uh, video description, um, but that's it. That is all I know about Markdown. So um, I hope you find it useful and you can start using this in your blogs and your GitHub um, workflow um, straight away. So uh, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.